In this video, we're going to determine whether there's a good business behind this stock and if its price is attractive enough to buy right now. I've split this analysis into two broad categories. The business, which makes up 75% of the analysis, and the price, which makes up 25%. First, let's look at the business side of our company. The best way to analyze the business is to see whether its metrics are better than the overall market. We're looking at growth, efficiency, dividends, effectiveness, speculation, relative value, mood, and opinion. We would prefer metrics 1 through 4 to be high and metrics 5 through 8 to be low. The first four deal with the fundamentals of the business and the next four deal with the fundamentals relative to the stock price. Pause this video if you need to read further. Here's how our stock and the overall market stack up against each other. Different points are awarded based on those comparisons. That is then translated into a grade by getting the company's points and dividing it by the combined total of both stocks. That's our business grade. Let's next take a look at the price of our company. The fair price is the true value of the stock. It can be a bargain down to being expensive. Here's our company's fair price and its relative percentage difference from its current price. That is then translated into one of five grades from 0 to 100. This is our price grade. Before we put everything together, join my Patreon. You'll get access to every company and ETF I've analyzed. It's updated all the time. Link on the screen and in the description. Let's then put everything together and get our final grade for our company. When we combine the company's business grade and its price grade, we get our final grade based on a 0 to 100 scale. The higher the grade, the better the investment. A grade of 50 is considered average and no better than investing in the overall market. Invest wisely. And as always, take care of your money.